Hi, it's Ashley from Sweet Dreams Bake Shop, and today I want to show you one of the ways that I like to utilize my leftover cake scraps. So all I'm doing is I'm taking a jar that I found from the dollar store and I dipped it in a little bit of white candy melts. You could choose to dip this in white chocolate or whatever other chocolate you have on hand. And then I go ahead and generously coat everything with this little sprinkle mix. Chocolate can harden fairly quickly depending on what temperature you have in your kitchen, so make sure that you do put those sprinkles on fairly quickly. I want it to kind of have a pinky effect to the rose, but not have it be a pure pink. So I'm just kind of putting in my food coloring here and then squishing it around in my piping bag. And this piping bag is fitted with a large petal tip. Today I'm using my favorite Italian meringue buttercream and I find this works best for any floral work. Because the rim is lined with sprinkles and I want to avoid any cake getting on the outside, which is what was happening when I was trying to use my spoon earlier, I am using chopsticks so I can get the most control. Creating the buttercream rose is actually a lot easier than you think. All I'm doing here is I'm creating little rainbow arcs. And this is much easier to do than doing it on a flower nail because we're not going to have to move this at all. It just gets directly piped onto the cake jar. I want my petals to be thinner at the top, so I'm making sure that the thinner side of the petal tip is pointing upwards towards the ceiling as I do this. Be sure to remember that the way that your rose turns out really relies on the angle of your piping tip. So all of us have some sort of angle or way that we hold our piping bag, so everybody's rose will turn out slightly different. The key is though to make sure that you keep overlapping all of those petals. Now let's get into the pricing. Now if these were on a custom order basis, I would charge $12 per cake jar. These are quite big, so they hold a lot of cake. And for a stock order, I would charge $10. And just a reminder that all my pricing is in Canadian dollars. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so you can be part of the Sweetie Fam. Right now, I'm uploading daily, so make sure you hit that notification bell so you know when I upload. Also, be sure to comment, request, or ask a question. I love hearing from you guys. Bye!